Sean Winchester from Kent, 502, Hoagie Wallace from Scotland. And we've seen him doing some very big hits on live TV. There's 901, Barry Simpson, and 107 from the depths of Cornwall, Mike May. He's probably the biggest traveller here today. But now we go back to the front row and get ready for this one, the big one, the main event with 88, Speedy Reed leading them round. And look at this. Are they going? And look at this, they've actually caught up with the back of the grid. That's how many cars there are. So 88, Speedy Reed in the Jag leads them. There's Lester Freestone in number 40, 287, Paul Totem there. The Yorkshire Yobo, Barry Simpson in 901. And here they come. And now they are starting to hit each other. Paranoid Paul taking a big whack. And oh, Mitchell McGee gets it all wrong at the end of the home straight. 517, Rowdy Roddy James goes through. Oh no! What a blitz there! Clyde Williams burying Simon Coxon, and there's another one! Well, a double follow in to start off the World Open. The Yorkshire Yobo just gets a nick. But what a sensational pair of hits there. In fact, Clive Williams has rolled himself with that one. The Wade Gallows are out. There's the 136 car rolled over. And oh no, another one goes flying in. That's Bruno Brunson in 537, one of the local heroes. 120, Shane Brown goes through and I can see red flags now. And uh, <laughs> goodness gracious me, and that 861 car of Simon Coxon dramatically folding up. Clyde Williams uh, bailing out as well, and he's having a look around now to see if there's anybody else involved in this pileup. And also the damage, there's Annette Nichols, beautifully turned out cow for today from the leading lady banger driver. She survived all that, thank goodness. These guys didn't. And they've got some work to do now to clear up the mess. And I can tell you that none of the drivers in those crashes were hurt. And while they're clearing up the mess, we'll cut the tape and we'll be back almost instantaneously. Eighty-eight, the last big money winner here at Swaffham, Speedy Reed, leading them round again for a complete restart. And you can see that his lovely paint job is now bearing a scratch or two. And uh, here we go, Sonic and Speedy at the front. And Brian McGuinness in trouble here. And Nogger just flicks out number 14, McGuinness, who actually holds on to that very well indeed. 120, Shane Brown. Oh! And Hoagie Wallace has a go in 5.02. 120, Shane Brown going well. In fact, Shane Brown's taken the lead now. 96, Kevin Wilshire, recently wed, but still with lots of energy. And here's Speedy Reed now getting through on the inside of 145, Sonic. 617, Jack Overy. Oh, I say, and Julian Watson has been annihilated by Kevin Wilshire. The 398 car folding on impact from 96. And 120, Brownie's been spun, so Sonic and Speedy's out on his own. 88, oh, what a hit there! 57, Basher Broad and 162, Brett Ellicott. Herbert's in a spin, it's in three, two, oh! And that in fact is the hit again from our front on camera. And look at that, looks like one of the Blues boys has gone piling into that earlier mess. God, truth. 736, Mitchell McGee now getting attacked by Nogger Hopkins in 827. Number 40, Freestone's in there as well. And this is a tremendous race. What an advert for demolition, destruction, and demon driving. 199, Phil Powell gets through. Speedy Reed's been spun. 308, Mark Cooper of 162, Brett Ellicott. Two of the West Country drivers that do well. Winchester has a go at James. Wilshire piles in two. For 57, John Broad continues to go around. 145, Colin Dickens waving because are we going to get another red flag here we might do you know the yellows were out and it's this crash again down here this time it's one of the blues boys in the middle of this and the reds are out and we're going to have another 
short break and we'll be back in seconds. So for the third time, here we go again and Jack over, he picks up Speedy Reed and tries to hook him out. Speedy hangs on to it brilliantly and over he nips through on the inside. 308 Cooper now right on his tail and look at the way Jack Overy 617 throws it into the bends. Well he loves the shale tracks does Jack Overy and he drives the tarmac tracks as if they were shale. Flinging the car in sideways and then powering it round. S57 Bash Broad number 14 McGuinness 199 pound this time Speedy's third left and again he's got away with it. Number 88 Alan Reed showing tremendous powers of recovery here. 57, John Broad just in through on the inside. 88, Speedy Reed, 367. Sean Winchester having a good old go at Reedy in 332. And number five now, Dave Eccles, the defending champion. He's still right there, but he's in a bit of trouble here. Jack Overy just lapping his former teammate, Brian McGuinness. 617, the race leader. 632 Neil Herbert and 236 Darren Herbert now muscling out Mark Cooper and look at the way Herbert's leaning on him going into the bend and now here comes the other Herbert and the Northampton boys doing a number on Mark Cooper it didn't quite come off Cooper takes the other Herbert in with him kind of a good driver 88 Speedy Reed now getting back into the race 145 Colin Dickin 811 Pete Winter 199 Phil Powell but this unlimited banger world open providing tremendous incidents and talking points there's Steve Farrell 200 the surviving blues boy and there's 617 Jack the dad Carl Overy the race leader but look at this he's got some serious opposition now from 162 Brett Ellicott <laughs> And 88 Speedy Reed and 145 Sonic still going well. 617 Jack the Dad and <laughs> another hit comes in there from the bad boy Brett Ellicott. But Overy hangs on to it brilliantly. And now Ellicott's in trouble from Herbert. And he may have got a flat with that last attack. Oh blimey! A 632 Neil Herbert slams into the fence. Bit of help from Sean Winchester on that crash. 811 Pete Winter, beautifully turned out car. 617. Carl Overy, the race leader. And John Broad, well, I'm not sure we've ever seen John do this many laps in car number 57. 96, Kevin Wilshire still going well. 145 Sonic in a bit of trouble now, but look at the paint job on that car magnificent what these guys do and there is 236 Darren Herbert 96 Kevin Wilshire now what will happen now Wilshire and Overy former teammates in the suicide squad and Jack the dad passing Wilshire the new hubby and it looks like uh, his ex-teammate has decided to let him go as Mark Cooper gets attacked by Basher Broad and Jack Overy smashes the pair of them out with a beautiful hit Number 57, John Broad, looking to get back into it. And <laughs> Sean Winchester this time decides to leave him alone. 617, Jack Overy, winning this main event. Kevin Wilshire now just riding shotgun, not in second place. He's a lap down in car number 96. Jack the Dad in first place. Is he going to be the new Unlimited Bangers world champion? 199 Phil Powell, number 5 Dave Eccles from opposite ends of the country converging here on Swaffham today as Basher Broad gets a little tap from Sonic in the 145 car 617 stylishly round the corners not looking for any big crashes now is Jack Overy and there's the checkered flag and 617 Jack the Dad is now Jack the Champion, the winner of the 1999 McDonald's Unlimited Bangers World Open here at Swatham today.
congratulations, Jack Overy.